He asked the presiding judge to step down. But I just want to put on the record that I would like to make an oral motion for you to recuse yourself as judge of this case because I do not believe that you can rule impartially and fairly. So I just want to make the record. Thank, Thank you. you. And that'll be denied. Of course, that's not all that happened today. There were some more fireworks. Hunter's attorney Clyde Bennett asked the judge to throw out a subpoena of a court reporter from the Cincinnati Inquirer, saying it was detrimental to his case, calling the reporter intrusive. He also said Hunter was scared of that reporter. The judge ultimately dismissed that claim as well, citing freedom of the press. I'm not going to order uh, anybody out because it might be a ploy. And I'm not saying that it is, but just to avoid the appearance of a ploy, I'm not going to, I'm, uh, I'm going to exercise, the court will exercise its discretion. Once again, opening statements are underway right now. You may recall that Hunter faces charges of forgery, theft in office, and tampering with evidence. Testimony starts tomorrow. Of course, we're going to have full coverage for, for you later on this evening right here on Nine on Your Side. But for now, reporting live from downtown, Zach Pitts, Nine on Your Side.